Okay, hey there again. So we have now downloaded the Unity game engine with version 2021.3.1 F1. So I suppose that you as well, uh, it took time for you to download it, especially if your internet is not that stable. So it would still depend upon on your internet connection. Well, anyway, we're not gonna talk deeply about internet connection. So as you can see here, I have just included the Windows build support wherein that's the platform uh, that our game will be, will be made for. So it is for Windows, uh, it is a Windows game. So if you want to add modules or platforms to your Unity version, you can just head to your um, installs yep installs and here select this uh, like setting button like yep and add modules so add modules and you can just have here if you want to build an android and select just android click this one if you're an ios or you have a mac computer you can just select this one and you're for universal windows platform if you want to publish it in Microsoft Store. So for now, we're just gonna have the Windows build support. So as for the IDE, I downloaded it separately in my case, but if you haven't uh, had the, and this one, Visual Studio Community, you can you uh, you could have just included it in, um, in your installation of your Unity game engine. So if otherwise, or if you are just like me, okay, you can just head over here and go to visualstudio.microsoft.com and just download Visual Studio Community so that uh, you will have this um, IDE for free. You will not be downloading professional unless um, I don't know. Well, anyway, uh, for in my case, I I just downloaded the Community 2022, wherein it is free so you can have that or you can just include it in the module so for the sprites so um just access the link that i'll be attached that i that i have already attached in the previous video and i will also attach it to this video so it is just a google drive link uh, i guess all of you knows how to um, download a file from a Google Drive. So I will not be showing that here. So let's have now, um, not that one. Why am I keep on clicking that? Um, so we're gonna open again the Unity Hub, and as, as you can see, we don't have any projects. And to have um, uh, to have project or create a project, let's select new project. Okay, there you have it. Okay, new project. And then, so our letter catch game is um, a 2D core. So just select the 2D core and um, write the name letter catch. So you can just do that. Uh, but for this um, instance, I'm just gonna make a Unity uh, interface. So I'll be showing you the 2D core Unity interface. So let's just create project. But for uh, the real project, just name uh, write the project name letter catch. So I'll, I'll be creating the project, the Unity interface. I'll just be showing you how Unity looks like. And here we have the um, Unity interface. So I don't know why is it anything appearing here. So you need a package cache. And anyway, I don't know. Why. So here, uh, so as you can see, we have here um, the hierarchy. We're in in this panel. We're gonna input or insert our game objects that will appear in our game or that will be used in our game. And here we have different tabs or when I will file. So if you want to save, new C, create a new C, new project. And as for here, one of the um, important components here on file tab is the build settings. 
so whenever we want to um, export this game to our uh, here we have here the Windows uh, build support so any scene that you have created in your game should be included here and then well that's for the hierarchy and here in the project panel we have the assets so every game assets especially the one that you will be downloading from the google drive link that i will be sharing uh, it will be dragged or imported here in this panel so once you have a game object here you're just going to simply drag it here to the hierarchy or simply here at the scene tab so this is the scene this is where you um where you work all your games um, or game objects for your games and here this will or execute everything that you code or included in the game so once you hit the play button it will um, automatically uh, transfer here in the game tab and everything will work so here in the inspector panel once you select um, for example here as a default um, every hierarchy um, in a game that is uh, about to be made so as a default there is already um, um, a game object which is the main camera so here the inspector panel um, all the properties of the game objects will appear here in the inspector panel and here for the style or the layout of your editor you can select it here but for our tutorial I'll just set it as default so if you want to explore this one you can just click it it's for example 2 by 3 or 4 split if you like it. Uh, if you want it like that but we're gonna set it only as default so and here the game object so if you want to add UI image or you can just simply uh, click it in here if you want to add um, an asset uh, which is uh, built inside the unit itself for example the UI uh, 2d game object 3d object create or empty game object so that's it for the uh, interface of the unity and for the next video we will now be having um, every um, ingredient for our game to be created 100% so see ya and enjoy this tutorial